This is how to fold your go from ride back into standby mode. The very first thing you're going to do is going to be to stow the handlebars. There is a trigger button here that is directly behind the LCD that is the pivot point. You will have to press this in that will release the ratchet and then you have to press the handlebars down to ensure that they are completely parallel with the stem. So one at a time. Now they're both parallel with the stem. Again, a mistake to avoid is do not leave it like this because it will not retract into the main body of the go if it is improperly uh, stowed. Second step is to, once again, find that white arrow and lift up the T-handle and then use it as your point of reference. Then you are going to press that orange button again and simply follow the whole thing down as you press and it retracts into the body. Now, the foot latch located over here is going to be the next release mechanism to uh, fold the main body back onto the footboard. The trick here is to apply a little bit of pressure on the foot latch, but not pull the main body towards the rear. Apply pressure on the foot latch and actually do the opposite. Gently pull slightly forward, and that releases the foot latch, and then you are able to lower it until it latches into place. Once you've latched it into place, simply lift back up. Now this is a natural occurrence. The Go is designed to lock into this three-point stance as this is the power assist stance. Not a, um, a problem, but in order to bring the wheels all the way back into standby mode, do not force the issue. Do not kick, do not push, you will break the joint. The release is this trigger latch that controls the hinge point that will allow the wheels to come back up. So as you pull the trigger latch, guide the wheels uh, all the way back into standby mode and then release and you're in standby mode.